Hey, what's up guys? It's Velvet! And I'm just making a really fast video for you. I'm like sitting on the floor. Um, don't worry about it, alright? I got the flash on. I'm blinding myself just for you. So today's video is me sharing a concept with you that God shared with me when I was listening to a sermon earlier. And the concept is God will chase us and bring us back to himself when we go astray, which we will. We are creatures that are prone to wander just like sheep. And God is called the good shepherd. And in Psalm 23, it says, his rod and his staff, they comfort me. And what that means, it means two things. One, he will go after us with his shepherd's hook and bring us back to the flock when we wander. And the second thing that that means is his tools of discipline in his words, his precepts, his statutes, aka his laws keep us safe from things that will, you know, harm us when they're not given at the right time or just harm us in general. But yeah, when I have thought of discipline my whole life, I just wanted to rebel and be like, I hate the man, I hate the government, I hate rules, like I'm just gonna be a little rebel. So anyway, that's another video for another time. But the point is, I always used to rebel not understanding why the rules were put in place. And I think we can all agree there's a lot of dumb laws that we can, we can do away with, but laws in themselves are good. They're created to keep us in line and out of trouble and from hurting other people. So, you know, like speeding the speed limit, all right, it's put in place for a reason. You know, it's certain speed limits are set in certain areas so you don't flip your car when you're going around a curve or you know because that area like especially New Hampshire is prone to black ice in the winter or you know because there's a lot of residents that live in that area you shouldn't drive a certain speed I mean they're, they're put there for a reason it's not to be controlling and like I don't want you to have any fun driving your car and God and his his word his rules his laws they're there for the same reason to protect us to help us live a great quality of life. So his rod and his staff, they comfort me. I'm actually comforted by his laws because I know that I'm gonna be protected. And it's just like a parent with their child. You set rules for your children so they don't get into trouble. And I just thought that that's how God must feel when we as his children do the right thing. He rejoices, he delights, he's like, oh, look at my child doing what she's supposed to be doing. And, you know, as the good shepherd that he is, he will go out and chase us and pursue us. And he doesn't get tired because he's God and he never runs out of strength or mercy or grace or love. But I know that he appreciates it when we obey him. He just delights and rejoices with us and we're filled with peace. He's always filled with peace, but he hates sin, so when we go astray and he has to come and chase us down, he's not happy about it, he's not thrilled about it, but he's going to do it because he loves us unconditionally. So anyway, those are just some thoughts that I wanted to share with you about our God and how great he is and how he'll just always go and pursue us and bring us back with his shepherd's hook. He'll bring us back to the flock and show us in the way that we should go. And his rod and his staff are there to comfort us because... We don't choose what we should choose. We don't choose what brings us real peace, real joy. We choose counterfeit things. We choose substitutes. We choose things that we think will make us happy. We think, you know, we want. And our flesh does want it. But God knows better what we need. And he will lead us in the way of righteousness. If we keep our eyes on him, but also if you're a child of his, he will always come back and bring you back to himself. So anyway, God bless you. I hope this message, um, yeah, just, I don't know. Hope it uh, gets you right here. I don't know. Uh, yeah, see you later, bye. Hey, what's up guys, it's Velvet. Um, 
thanks for watching this video, my random thoughts. Be sure to hit the, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I'll see you guys later.